Hi guys, Dom D. Calx here with a tutorial on a program on how to make the Pythagorean Theorem not only f to find the hypotenuse but also the leg. It's a nifty little program and uh, I like it a lot so let's get started. So first you're going to need to start a new program. So create a new one and name it if you like. Um, I'm going to name mine P Theorem. So P Excuse my terrible spelling. And hit enter. Alright, once you got it named, what you need to do is go into program. Then scroll all the way down until you find label. And then hit 1. And then hit enter. Then go back to program. Scroll down until you find menu. There it is. Hit enter. Now hit second alpha and then hit plus and then type in find. So F I N D and then hit the minus or the negative sign at the bottom, then hit plus again, then hit alpha, then hit comma, then hit second alpha again, then hit plus, and then type in L E G for leg plus again, then hit alpha, then a comma, then hit two, then comma again, then second alpha plus, and then type in hypotenuse. I'm not really sure exactly how to spell it, so I'm going to guess. Then once you've done that, hit plus again then hit alpha, then hit comma, three comma, then second alpha again, plus, and then type in exit. Where's the X? Uh, I T. Then hit plus, then comma, or hit alpha, comma, four parentheses. Then hit enter. Now, go back up to program and find label again. And this time hit 2. Then hit enter. Then program again. Display second plus, or second alpha, then plus. Then type in input hypotenuse. Again, I'm not really sure how to spell it. So, hopefully you guys do. Pot and news, maybe. Then hit plus. Then hit enter. Program. Scroll over to the right. Then hit enter. An input should come up. And then hit alpha math. Then hit enter again. Then hit program, go back over to display, and this time hit alpha, second alpha, then plus, and then type in input leg. Then hit the plus sign again, then hit enter, program, go over once, hit input, this time hit alpha apps, then hit enter. Now hit program, scroll to the right, select display, hit enter, and type in second x squared, which is just the uh, square root symbol, and then type in second math squared minus, or alpha math, sorry, squared minus alpha apps squared, and parentheses. Hit enter, then hit program, then scroll down until you find pause, hit enter, and then hit enter again, and then hit program again, and then scroll down until you find go to, and then hit one, then hit enter, then hit program, and search, scroll down until you find label, this time 
hit number three. Then hit program, scroll over once, down to display. And this time type in, or hit second alpha plus, and then type in input leg one. parenthesis or er, plus and hit program write input this time hit alpha program then hit program again scroll over and down to display and hit second alpha again and hit the plus sign and this time type in input leg where's the L leg two Then hit out, or then hit the plus sign again. Then hit enter. Then program. Scroll over to the right. Select input. Hit enter. It's time. Hit alpha x to the negative first. Then hit enter. Then select program. Scroll to the right. Down to display. And this time, type in second x squared, which is the square root sign again. And then this time, type alpha program squared plus alpha x to the negative first squared. And parenthesis, hit enter, then go back into your program, then scroll down until you reach pause, and hit enter again, then hit program again, and then scroll down until you find go to and then hit one and then go back into program scroll down until you find label select it hit four hit enter then go back into programs and scroll down until you find stop there it is hit enter and that should do it I'm just going to scroll back up to the top and make sure I have everything correct. I do. So second quit. Hit program. Go back. Find out which one it is. We called it P theorem, or at least I did. Go ahead and run it. And so here's what happens. It gives you a menu. You can either choose to find the leg, the hypotenuse, or you can exit the program. So let's say you need to find a missing leg. You would hit enter and then they're supposed to give you the hypotenuse so let's say the hypotenuse was 98 and the leg that you did have was 7 the other leg would have to be 97.74968031 whatever units it's in then hit enter and it'll take you right back to the menu where you can either choose another leg choose hypotenuse which is again the same thing. Input the f leg you get, which is 9, let's say. And then let's say the other leg is 6. The hypotenuse would be 10.8 inches. And then hit enter, and it takes you back. So if you want to leave the program, you just scroll down to exit, hit enter, and you're done. You're back to your regular calculator. Alright guys, see you on the next video.